Okay, today I'm going to be showing you how to get the perfect explosion in your microwave. See what I did there? Explosion. So if you're not familiar with my microwave yet, I figured out a way to film inside the microwave so I can do cool experiments that you've never seen this clear in the microwave because you don't have to see it behind that annoying mesh. So eggs can pack quite an explosive punch in the microwave. So the reason why eggs are explosive in a microwave is because the shell doesn't absorb microwaves very well but the inside liquid does absorb microwaves. And so the liquid inside starts to heat up more and more and more until eventually it starts to evaporate all of the liquid in there, but there's nowhere for it to expand. So the pressure just builds up more and more and more until the shell actually cracks. And because this egg shape is so structurally strong, it can actually hold quite a lot of pressure in there before it explodes. And so you get this explosive decompression when it finally gives. So if you do try this at home, remember it's at your own risk and you have to clean your own microwave. So to get the most explosive explosion in your microwave, you're gonna want a turntable. So the reason you want this turntable is because you want the egg to be spinning so that it heats evenly throughout the egg. If not, it's just going to heat more on one side of the egg and most likely it'll just pop open. It won't be a big explosion. So the egg can be either laying flat or up on its end. I've had the most luck with it up on its end like this. You can just get a lid to put it in, a soda lid works or any type of lid. Then just put it in the microwave and watch what happens. After around 45 seconds, it'll explode. Here's what it looks like. Okay, exploding egg in a microwave. Three, two, one. Whoa! Okay, so here's the aftermath of that explosion. Look at that. <laughs> Just demolished the egg. I've got some cleaning up to do here. Okay, this one was really cool. I only noticed it when I was editing the video. There it goes. So notice how when it explodes, the egg yolk only pops out of the egg. And then once the egg yolk pops out, once it hits the glass plate, the egg yolk itself explodes. I'm guessing it's because it gave it a nucleation spot to start boiling instantly and then it, that's what made it explode. So you can see if I don't use the turntable and I just put it in the back, here's what happens. It just kind of splits open, doesn't really explode. So besides explosions, you can get really cool works of art like I just discovered here. So I call this one Egg Frozen in Time. I'm thinking of selling it on eBay, how much should I sell it for? No, that's not a picture. That's just me holding my egg frozen in time. <laughs> Thanks for watching another episode of the Action Lab. Let me know what you'd like to see in my top secret microwave in the comments section or anything else you want to see me do or any questions you have for me, let me know. And if you're not subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button, hit the bell button to be notified when my latest video comes out and I'll see you next time.